Hello, it's Jen again. Uh, today I'm going to talk about following your gut instincts as parents. Um, well, I've got a little story to go with it. Um, when my son was 15, he's 18 now, but when he was 15, one day we were in the kitchen, he reached across the counter and I saw this dark spot on his arm, which is not odd. My kids and I are pretty fair skinned and, and we've got moles all over the place, but for some reason this mole stood out to me. And I said, Ethan, how long have you had that? And he looked at me and went, I don't know. And I said, well, we should probably have it looked at. So I let a little time go by and it kept nudging me. Like, you need to go get that looked at. So I made an appointment. We went in to see his regular doctor. She took a look at it and said, yeah, it's kind of funky. Measured it, put the dimensions into her computer. Yeah, we should send you to a dermatologist. So we went to the dermatologist and it took us a while to get in. Um, but once we got there, it took like two months to get in. Once we got there, um, she took a look at it and said, yeah, we should probably just biopsy that and take it off. Let's schedule an appointment to have it removed. It had already taken me two months to get in. So I looked at her and I said, why don't we just take it now? And you could tell she was kind of annoyed with me and said, well, if we don't, you know, take it off just right, it could leave a scar. And I said, yeah, he's a 15 year old boy. I don't think he's gonna care. So they took it right there and it was like a day or two later i got a phone call i was at work and i remember answering the phone and hearing this girl on the other end say oh, i'm looking for jen and i said oh i'm jen the doctor would like to talk to you and my heart sank because when does the doctor ever want to talk to you unless it's bad so uh she got on the phone and she said the results came back from your son's biopsy it's malignant melanoma and it's really rare for a 15 year old kid to have that we've got a surgeon that's going to be calling you to get you in for surgery <sighs> how do you even you know I, at this point in my life i had already been through some cancer with my ex-husband and it was terrifying and so uh, i couldn't figure out how i was gonna tell my son that he had skin cancer but um we went through everything, decided we were gonna take a lymph node and, and they were gonna take a, you know, way more skin off of his arm, make sure they had gotten it all. And I remember sitting in the, the hospital room with my son as they were getting ready to take him in for his surgery and the nurse looked at me and she said, how did you even guess? Like, how did you even find it? And I looked at her and I said, I just had this feeling. And she looked at me and she said, good job, mom. And my son is now fine. Um, they took another little bit of skin off of his foot, but he's healthy, he's good. And what I learned from that was when you have that intuitive nudge, you jump on it. You don't sit around. If you have that gut feeling to move, move. That's your job as a mom and a dad. Um, that's my little story. Uh, we all love our kids. We all want the best for them. When you get that urge, jump on it. Have a good day. Hey, like and subscribe too.